Here we have the Reiner Jet Stamp 1025. I'm going to show you how to insert and take out a cartridge. Start by clicking the power button to turn the device on. It will go through its booting. It will show you the firmware and the serial number on the screen. Uh, you can see here it says no print cartridge. In order to put in the cartridge, you have to take off the battery cover. So here we have the cover and you can either use this little textured area or this spot right here to just pull this flap towards you and then lift up and that will remove it. So you're going to take a cartridge, remove the plastic clip. We have the print head here. This is where the ink comes out of. In order to insert the cartridge, you want this little flap facing you. So you can either hold that here or here. And you're going to flip this red clip up. This is where the cartridge is inserted. Holding it at a slight 45 degree angle might help you to get the cartridge situated correctly. So we're going to take the cartridge, place it in, and then just close this clip until it's completely seated. Now we can take this cover and this tab goes in the bottom, clicks into place. You can press this button to return it to the home. That cartridge carrier is now seated at home. And then you can use any of the three trigger points, so one, two, three under here, to print. And every time you click the button, it's going to print what shows on the screen. You can change what shows on the screen by using these little arrows, and it will show anything that you've programmed. In order to take the cartridge out, you're going to again hit this eject button. The carrier will move over to the right. Again, we're going to remove this cover. Flip up this red clip to release the cartridge. Pull the cartridge out. Place the plastic protective clip back on the cartridge. and store it facing up. That's the best way to protect the clip, uh, the, the print head. And then you can just place the cover back on the machine. And turn the machine off. Thanks for watching.